Hello, I am Fantastic and Fantastic, and today I'm going to be playing through the new latent Tamadra Challenge 3 of my Erd plus Dark Omega team. So I just brought lots of orb changers and ways to potentially cycle those orb changers and Elena for Fire Skyfall buff, so I don't want to worry about much at all whatsoever. And I brought one L Awakening because there are some locked orbs and just easy to deal with for all my orb changers. Using my little Uriel here. Mm, my one Christmas Uriel I got from some time long ago. I love it. And then I'm gonna use Elena, because it gives me the orb unlock, so I don't have to worry about these locked nonsense. Rodrigo, it's nice because I don't want well, it gives me a gives me more active skill diversity. It gives me a better turn one option to cut my health. I like it so far. It's a little angry. I'd be too if I was like that. Extreme King Metal Dragon. Like, I'd be pretty angry too if I'm just getting smacked by a cheapy bird. Like, that's almost insulting. It's like, I'm a big strong dragon. Nope, you're getting smacked around by a little dinky thing. Oh, I should really cut my hand. I'll do that. Go for a Dark Absorb, don't match Dark Me. No, I don't have enough orbs. No! I'm just gonna use an active skill to get more orbs. Yes. I don't need combo count bonus anymore because there's nothing of a big combo shit in this dungeon. That's left over from a previous one of these. my health, overcome you. Oops, did not mean to match that many red orbs. Luckily I have so many still. I'll deal with these poison orbs somehow. I realize Nidhogg's about to charge up. Oops, I should have put this poison up somewhere else. I'm not gonna bother trying to overcome a combo shield like that. I'm gonna put Uriel at the bottom in a sec. Mega later, maybe. Okay, Uriel is still ready, thank you. Where are my red orbs? There's enough, thank you. I can overwrite this time to be back now. Pretty easy. Okay, that's way too many combos. Erd is nice for this over- well, Erd doesn't care about time debuffs, I should say. Oh yeah, this is where things could be annoying. I'm gonna use Amaterasu to haste it up, because that's smart. Then I can cheat the Erd immediately. And then cut my health. Amazing. Oh yeah! Big money. Oh, that was a small money. That was a bad combo. Hey, we did it! Not too shabby. Plenty of time to spare in this one. Okay, I feel like once I got the first one down, the rest kind of fall into place. We have a similar team template. I think the first one is just more obnoxious because the color absorb, damage absorb 
forces you to have certain actives. But hopefully this final video, if you watch them in the correct order, provides more inspiration or additional insight as to what you can expect from these dungeons. It's definitely worth playing through and clearing them because they give tasty rewards. And if you have a team of like, you know, Skyfalls or attack roll below 50%, or especially teams that don't rely on matching many combos, these become significantly easier to manage. So hopefully you have a fantastic day. I wish you all the best luck in your own pad adventures and happy puzzling.